I think one thing I would just like to bring up is that often working as a tipped employee, you are doing work that is not typically considered to be tipped labor. Uh, so side work, you're polishing glasses, um, but even in the inventory in the back storeroom uh, on a slow day, there are all sorts of tasks that uh, are not tipped work that you wind up taking on. And then say you get a table, um, the tip that you get from that table is going to be applied to then pay for this work that you've been doing for the restaurant that isn't really tipped labor. Um, as an example, in the restaurant that I worked in, on um, busy nights there would be a hostess who's a non-tipped employee, uh, making around $10 an hour. Um, that was on only on Friday and Saturday nights. However, sometimes there are busy nights during the middle of the week, and as an employee at a restaurant, you're, you have to work as a team. So on, uh, on a weekday night, there's no hostess, you're working as both server and hostess. Uh, you're doing a job for someone who would normally, on a, when they have someone there, is making $10 an hour, but instead you're doing both jobs and your tips are making up that, you're not making a minimum, a regular minimum wage and then getting your tip on top of that. Your tip is going and making up the difference for labor that is really beyond what a tipped employee does. I'm sure anyone who's worked in a restaurant knows this. You do all. There's all sorts of responsibilities um, that don't that don't necessarily fall under the job description that you are expected to take on. And if I were to, at my job, say, I'm I, I am only working uh, the two hours. I think it's two hours before and after. You're supposed to be allowed to be doing uh, ancillary work. Uh, if I was to say, no, I'm not going to do side work right now because I already did two hours of it, I would be immediately fired. So you wind up doing a lot of labor that is not, uh, that is not tipped labor, and then if you get a tip, that, that ends up being, it's as if the restaurant is getting free labor for, uh, and the tip is just paying for that operation. 